We're making a meat run. Well, that's a good fish. Oh right? uh, yeah. I'm stoning them. They can have all the cr all the chinky pins they want. <laughs> this is what I want right here. <laughs> we like Arby's. We got the meat. Would you open that there live well for me, please? I got you. Of course, I'm chinky pin are from the kit. My personal favorite color for Clearwater Lake. Killer clap. You're seeing fish look at it oh, and yeah. they don't eat it. One, two things. You either suck or you got the wrong bait. In this case, it could be both. But if you don't think it is, I'm going to go smaller. Try that out and see what happens. Not the one you just locked, though. What a good one. That's what I'm talking about. Killer clat in his mouth. Mm. Big one's coming there, too. Got him. <laughs> <laughs> Him out away from the hole, didn't mm -hmm. he? That's awesome. Tell Jay that one eight's not working. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a big one, too. Good one. We got the meat. No oh, oh my goodness, that was a giant crappie. God. I, saw I got a net right there. But I ain't never had a problem. That's a big fish right there. Yeah, it was. Are you kidding me? All right, John. All right, show me that knot. All right, so here's the deal. I'm not tying a loop knot. This is the knot I tie because it's quick and it's strong. Basically, you run the line through the jig and let it hang down. See how it's just swinging back and forth? Mm -hmm. Now, in my right hand, I make a gun. And I hold the line in the three fingers. Rod, hold that rod right there. <clears throat> Basically, you hold the, the gun like that. I got the line coming through my three fingers. And right here is what I'm going to pinch the line with. Now, you can see the line's coming down, going through the jig. And I got this little tag right there. See that little tag? Yeah. That's what I'm going to flip it over. I'm going to flip it over that tag five, six times. And then now in my right hand, it's created the loop for me. Oh, yeah. And this puts the this puts the 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 knot on the back side of it, which tightens it down from the top side. Just wet it. Once you pull a little snug, then you can just start sliding it down. Got to watch this light line stuff. It'll make it kinky quick. Just pull it tight. I'm ready to go. It's called huh. a pitson knot, but uh, a lot of people do it a little different way. You can use the lure to spin it around. That's what I like about it. I can tie it really quick. Pretty fast, yeah. Now, yeah. Show me where the fish are now. All right, let's go. call these things down here? White perch. White perch. Yeah. They grow off the and end of them slab curlers. They grow off the end of them. They That's grow off the end of them. Man. 
You throw a slab curly in there and a, a fish will grow off the end of it. I see it. It was growing right there. I see the yep. hole is growing. Oh, yeah. I got you. It's like a root. I don't think anything white about this thing. That's the thing I don't get. Well, this is the black crappie species. Oh. Black crappie, white crappie, white perch. Mm. Sacolab if you're behind, below I-10. Gotcha. But look how thick. I know thing. what I'm talking about. Specs. What about that? Daddy called them specs. Specs. Yeah, that's what Florida people call them. Specs. Yeah. Where I grew up, they call them crappies. There ain't nothing crappy about them. I know. Ain't nothing crappy about them. All right. Put him back in here, buddy. <laughs>